Top 10 ghost videos so scary, I had to have emergency surgery. Ookie wookie. River's Edge. Cambodian Paranormal Investigation Team RC Fun TV2 travels to an allegedly haunted area along the bank of a river. The locals tell stories of many horrible incidents that have taken place in this small area, right at the river's edge. Guys, I'm eating the orange. It is said that a young boy was swept away in a mudslide in this area, and sadly, he perished in the flood. Another tale recounts that a man took his own Something's off. Oh my god. I think it's growing. You see, it's like growing out. I didn't do anything. Look. Oh my god. I mean, I'm. Alright, that was the only piece. I'll put Life it. at the river's edge. And then, even more tragedy. Oh shit. Because the graves of several children can be found here, buried along the river bank. Because this spot has such a horrible history. The RC Fun TV team decides to leave offerings and prayers for any distressed spirits that might be unable to move on to the other side. And not long after leaving their offerings, the paranormal investigators spot something truly terrifying. What do they see? Hmm. Whoa, 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 I saw it, I saw it. Holy shit. That's just a nigga. It's just a dude. Wait, 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 wait. Where's his face? Where's his face? No way, stop playing with me. Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. The investigators spot what appears to be a man sitting on the edge of the river, but something is very off about the mysterious figure. The man My boy just swimming, for real? He's not doing shit? Is unrecognizable. When the team attempts to get closer, the stranger disappears underwater, never to be seen again. The RC Fun TV team say that they might have just seen the spirit of the man that took his own life on the riverbank, or perhaps even the boy that drowned in the flood. But is it real, or is it all just an elaborate hoax? You the world decide, may never know. Stray away. It's late in the afternoon when a CCTV camera in the city of Angle, Chile, captures a teenage girl presumably walking home from school. Mm -hmm. What happens next is absolutely chilling. Okay. What? What happens? She's gonna disappear. Someone captures her? She gets stolen. Oh my god, they're gonna capture her. Oh my god, they're gonna capture her. Oh my god, she's gonna get taken. Oh no! Fuck! Run! Run, 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 run! That dog just saved your fucking life. That dog just saved your fucking life. W dog. W fucking dog. The girl is walking down a secluded alleyway when a silver Nissan pulls up to the teenager and a man can be seen talking to the girl with a weapon in his hand. The girl is terrified and instinctively walks backward away from the car. When the men then back up their car to follow her, suddenly a little stray dog comes running out of the W fucking and dog starts barking at the dangerous strangers. The little dog effectively saves the teenage girl from what we can only assume would have been a horrible fate. The video about the heroic little dog went viral on the internet, with many people giving praise to the stray for recognizing the threat and protecting a complete stranger from harm. Now without a source... Bro, these niggas gotta watch. 
These niggas gotta watch fucking hor like safety videos, bro. It's it's like rule number one: a car pulls up next to you, you run the opposite way and start screaming. That's like the first safety video you watch in like the fourth grade, and she looks like she's past the fourth grade. That's like the first safety video you watch, bro. Literally the first one. If a car pulls up next to you and asks for anything, you scream as loud as you can and run the opposite way from where the car is, so they have to reverse. This is rule number one, bro. Like, this is rule number, like, do I have to, like, no one has to say this to anybody. It's Chile? All right, well, someone needs to play these safety videos over there. Because these niggas obviously need it. Like, what? I unfortunately don't know what happened to the little dog after it ran out of frame. But as for the footage. Next person who says, got ban them all. It just goes to show again. That ban them all. are always scarier. I don't like minorities in my chat. <laughs> They don't belong. They're second class citizens. Get the fuck out of here. Not a helping hand. This next video was posted to Facebook by Marla to share. I almost ate the orange again. From Richmond, California. Marla says that she was rearranging some furniture in her son's bedroom and recorded a video of the room's final look to show to her daughter. But when she watches her video back, she spots something downright chilling. Whoa, 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 what the fuck is that? She's completely alone in the room when no, you're what not. appears to Stop be playing. a little hand. Can this is definitely a prank. Son's cabinets. Come on, bro, this Even is a prank. Creepier. Viewers pointed out that a man's voice seems to quietly whisper. No, no, I can't buy that one. They're playing. Now, Marla posted the video to Facebook in hopes of getting any thoughts or ideas on what she might have captured. She says that other than one strange incident with a fan switch turning itself off and on in her son's room, she's never really experienced anything paranormal in the house. So what do you think this is? Before we move on to the next video, if you see anything that you think should be included in the top five, contact us at nukestop5 at gmail.com. Encounter of the Third Kind. The following is a very old video from the depths of the internet. Source unknown. So, a group of friends are hanging out, drinking and having a good time in the woods of Flacy, France. Suddenly, they spot what they believe to be a dog hiding behind a tree. Where is it at? Vous avez vu un truc encore? Bouger? Bon, toi là. Y'a un truc là-bas? Where's the dog? I don't see shit. Where's the dog? He's a cute dog. What fucking dog, nigga? What is with this Android quality, nigga? We're in 2020. Oh, you said it was old video. You're right. What? What? I don't see shit. Oh my god, what is that? That is not a dog. That is a fucking alien. That's an alien, my nigga. You just found E.T. Capture this nigga. Something otherworldly can be seen moving around behind the tree. Something with long fingers and an unusually large skeletal head. The video abruptly cuts and what happens next remains a mystery. So could it be that the group had an encounter with an alien? Or just what is that? Let me know what you think. Hunting the unknown. If I caught an alien, if I caught an alien, bro, I'm either going to make become close friends with it, or if it's dangerous, I'm selling that bitch for no less than $40 million. <laughs> all right, no less. All right. Honestly, might go up to a billion. Might go up to a billion dollars. I'm just gonna be. I'm just gonna be honest with you. I'm just gonna be honest with you. It's either we're great friends, or I'm selling it for for no like forty million to to a billion. Depends. Depends. Depends on how many people are in the market for an alien, bro. And yeah. <laughs> Alex from the YouTube channel Hunting the Unknown sets out to investigate a restaurant in England that's been abandoned for over 20 years. 
The owners of the restaurant are said to have abruptly. This nigga said, "I'ma smash the alien." My nigga, stop watching hentai, bro. Let let it go, please. <laughs> please. After being tormented by severe from England, back. Alex, hunting the unknown. Paranormal investigator Alex from the YouTube channel Hunting the Unknown sets out to investigate a restaurant in England that's been abandoned for over 20 years. The owners of the restaurant are said to have abruptly fled the property after being tormented by severe paranormal activity. The abandoned and broken down structure is located deep in the middle of the woods and Alex is all alone as he begins his investigation in the dead of night. After setting up a motion detecting music box in the bar section of the restaurant, Alex already begins to experience strange activity. Y'all don't hear that? Does nobody hear that sound? Still do walk free. What the Hello? fuck is that? Hello? What happened? Hello? Oh, hell no. A static camera captures the moment a door slams by itself. Oh, shit. But things are about to get even weirder. Alex decides to do a spirit box session in the hopes of catching some paranormal activity. Where are you? Guys, this orange is looking kind of feisty. Piece. I'm just going to take small pieces. Just tiny pieces from it, right? Oh, you know. What the f Alex asks for a sign, and bottles sitting on the bar seem to be pushed over on their own. But it's when he takes a closer look at the bottles that he captures something truly disturbing. I don't understand how these were locked down. It's crazy, I don't understand this. I'm pretty sure this is like that. Hello? Hello? What do you see? Hello? I just see too much stuff down in there. Who's there? Shit is moving behind you, Cass. The dark silhouette Chill, bro. figure can be seen standing in a room right across from Alex. I thought now, it was a mirror. Alex doesn't notice the figure at first, but when he moves towards the door, he realizes that something is not quite right. Huh. He inspects the room to make sure no one is there, but he gets the unsettling feeling that he's being watched. Alex no longer feels safe in the remote building and all by himself. So he decides to just get out of there. Uh -huh. You but, can watch this entire uh. investigation and many more spooky videos over on the YouTube channel Hunting, hunting the, the unknown. unknown. The thing from the cave. Shit, I hate cave Japanese videos. Paranormal I fucking hate cave Kitano, ones. Daichan and Yasuke are contacted by one of their viewers about a bizarre picture they took in an allegedly haunted cave in Fukuoka Prefecture, Japan. The picture shows what appears to be a woman peeking from a rock inside the caves. The location is said to be a paranormal Why are you hotspot, going back? And many visitors claim to have Why seen are you going back? apparition of a lady dressed all in white. Oh shit. It's late at night when the clip store team carefully make their way deep underground into the cave system to search Nigga, for the spot where bugging. the photo was taken. Y'all niggas are bugging. You're bugging. You're bugging. <laughs> I think I'm bugging, nigga. I gotta be bugging. I gotta be bugging. 
There it is, there it is. There's the rock, right? Oh, yeah, that's it. It's awful in here. Could have been a person. The clip store team manages to find the exact location of the photo. But now, with all three members so cramped in such a tiny cave tunnel, Yasuke and Daichan decide to head back out and wait in the car. Gachan stays behind to listen and look for anything strange. Gachan has been in the dark cave for about 20 minutes when this happens. Unexplained sound. Sounds like water. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Where's his, where did his friends go? They went back, it said? I we know that's not his friends making the noise. While sitting in the dark, Kachan is a little freaked out when he suddenly hears what sounds like a woman crying from somewhere deep within the caves. Meanwhile, waiting back in the car, Yasuke and Daichan also experience something terrifying. Today is your first time with us, how was it? All the bats were hibernating. This time they were constantly flying around. It really felt like we were in hell. That was a really tough shoot. It really... Whoa. Oh. Did you see it? Someone can be seen sitting right outside the passenger seat window. Oh, I didn't even see that. Just watching Daichan and Yasuke. Then there are two loud bangs, one from the back of the car and one from the front. As the camera pans back toward the passenger window, oh, you can shit. see that the creepy figure seems to have disappeared. But that's not all that happened that night. Because early on, back in the caves, yeah. there was something else. Huh. While the clip store team are all climbing down the rocks, their viewers pointed out that something else might have been there with them. Huh. Watch again very closely. Okay. Oh, shit! Oh, oh shit! It can be seen moving up above them as if following them down into the caves. But the clip store guys don't see or hear anything. So could it be that they had an encounter with the strange apparition of the woman in white? That's just a bat? Area? You think it's just a bat? Let me know what you think. You can watch this entire investigation over on the YouTube channel, Clip Store. Be honest. Be honest. You're in the car. You and your boy are in the car. You have another friend that's in, that's in the cave using the bathroom, and you guys hear knocking on the car window. Are you leaving your boy or what? Are you leaving him? Be honest. Are you leaving him? Yes or no? Or are you saying, nah, I'm waiting for my bro to come back? And then we're out. Hmm? Depends on how well you know him. You know him super well. Y'all been boys since you were little. Hmm? Y'all been boys since you were little. You're not leaving him? You're waiting for bro? Okay. Okay. How about what if you just found out he fucked your girl? Like you're in the car, you get a text message from your girl saying, I have something to tell you. While you were sleeping the other day, I invited your boy over and we had sex in your living room. 
What are you thinking? I'm out. Yeah. Uh, you're still waiting? He getting left and no one is coming back. <laughs> Graveyard shift. TikTok user Veronica is working the night shift on the second floor of the Baylor Scott and White Medical Center in Rowlett, Texas. Suddenly, they start. Nigga said, "If he did a good job, yes." Truly creepy. Shit, you have to listen very carefully. Night shift at the hospital. Did you hear her? Yes. Oh shit! Hear I heard her? that. Yeah. Are there not people in the hospital? Like patients? Don't people stay overnight? Like, it's a hospital. They were sleeping so we could have woke them up. What? They woke them up. Huh. Oh, nobody's in there. This is awkward. I think I'm her mom. That was you. No, I swear to God. Was that something? Huh? <laughs> Veronica and her co workers hear the sound of someone humming or singing. Did you hear her? Yes. You hear her? That was you. No, I swear yeah, someone definitely humming in your ear right now. And a door opens by itself. Night shift worker Veronica explains that she believes that several ghosts haunt the Baylor Hospital. But she says that one of them, the ghost of a young girl, can often be heard laughing and singing throughout the hallways, as if trying to reach out to the staff. So is the hospital haunted by the spirit of a young girl? Let me know what you think. The Mysterious Mannequin. Aww. This next eerie clip was posted by TikTok user The Truth 444 the video shows a tourist in Paris stopping at the storefront of the famous and very controversial brand Balenciaga. Yeah. The woman notices something in the store window that is truly disturbing. Okay, people, tell me something. So this is a store. In is that Paris. a mannequin? This That's is a, a mannequin. Store in Paris, and this is a, a um, mannequin. That's a mannequin. That. They made this <laughs> and put this in the store. Oh this my god. It look like somebody dead and bombed. On God. Wait, I'm doing it through the hole. Look at the boy hands. Look, the hands. Yo, his that hands, looks real as shit. His hands is as real as mine. The woman is freaked out by a mannequin that looks I like a would be too. Bit. Too real. Too real. But things are about to get even weirder. Watch closely. If anybody have this guy missing, please. <laughs> this is crazy. I've never seen anybody look so freaking real. How you have this man in other store sit on? Look. <laughs> look at that. You see? This, this is freaking crazy. Look at Wait, did the guy. eyes change? And them said they made this mannequin. And put clothes on him and have him sit down in the window. Look at the guy friggin' face. He's Did his eyes change? If you know anyone that missing a black son look like this, he's <laughs> in the store in the window. The mannequin suddenly appears to be looking directly at the woman. I think she changed the angles though. Creeped out by the sudden change in position, and some even swear. Did it move? Can see the mannequin blinking. The video gets a massive amount of attention as viewers begin to make wild claims that the multi-billion dollar fashion brand Balenciaga has embalmed one of their models and that the mannequin isn't a mannequin at all, oh. but is in fact a missing model by the name of Christopher Tyler. 
The claims become even stronger after Christopher Tyler seems to drop offline. He stops modeling, and mysteriously his Instagram account is suddenly set to private. People became so disturbed by the ultra lifelike mannequin's resemblance to model Christopher Tyler that Chris had to actually post an Instagram oh, okay, live okay. addressing that he's he was good. safe. He's and good. Actually, very much alive. Okay. Like, I appreciate everybody concerned, but you know, you can't feed into whatever you see on the internet. Nah, you a clone, bro. I'm not gonna lie. I'm a big pig. They clone me. <laughs> everything, everything in the book. Everything in the book. But all of this really doesn't explain why this creepy mannequin seems to stare at this tourist who gets too close. Insane. The hospital visitor. This next creepy video was was posted to the internet without a source. It is said that the video was taken by a patient in a hospital in Indonesia. Allegedly, he recorded the video to reassure his friends and family that he's safe and in good hands. But when he looks back at his own footage, he sees something so disturbing that he no longer feels safe at all. Oh shit. A dark figure veiled Whoa. in black can be seen oh, watching over another patient. Get the fuck. Now, that on its own is not that scary, but the man recording the video claims that there was no one there at the time. What do you he mean? He says that there was no dark figure. Now, many viewers of the video have said that the eerie figure appears to be floating, and that is they it? believe the apparition might be the Grim Reaper, oh, patiently shit. awaiting the patient's death. That's crazy. But I'll leave that up to you to decide. Thank you so much for watching. If you haven't already that nigga, subscribed, that nigga Grim Reaper cheating for that, ain't ain't that cheating? You can't just wait by a nigga deathbed. That's cheating. Do it now, and then also turn on all notifications so you never miss a video. You can also follow me on the socials and just say uh, hi there, Nuke. Anyway, hopefully I will see you next video. W. W, W, W freaking vids, guys. W freaking vids. W freaking vids, man. Holy moly. Holy moly.